Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. Um, so once again, I'm doing a retake. Um, this is my close, well, gosh darn it. This is my, uh, close to my heart haul. This is the per the last purchase I made to meet my quarterly, uh, minimum. And so I was going to show you what I picked up. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around a spell. If you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button, ding the bell next door if you want to get notifications of future videos. Thumbs up, likes are always appreciated. Any questions or comments, please leave them down below. A uh, little disclaimer again, if you're new, I am a consultant for Close to My Heart, but if you follow along, you'll notice that I rarely discuss it um, just because I consider myself an equal opportunity crafter and I love anything and everything out there regardless of who the um, company is. So, um, yeah. So if you have any questions, just leave them down below or shoot me an email. I'm happy to help. And, um, yeah. So let's, let's see what I picked up. So we're going to start with the stamp sets. Um, I, are they over here? Yeah. Okay. We're going to start with the minis. And um, all of these are stamp sets that can only be given to you from a consultant. They aren't out for purchase. Um, and so um, the fir this first one um, I showed in the last haul. And I picked up uh, two more because one of them I'm sending to uh, an individual who requested and placed an order. And so um, there's one of these that are waiting to go out. But these ones here I'm going to show you are going to be a future giveaway as a set. So it's going to be this one including um, I Like You a Waffle Lot. And they're not big stamps. They're just cute little petites, hint petite perks. So there's that one. Then this one's called Dollop of Thanks. And it says, thanks for putting up with me. But ching ching There we go. Then um, this one is called Feeling Fancy, and it says Bonjour. That's fancy for hey. And last, this is a Christmas throwback called Believing is Seeing. So seeing isn't believing, believing is seeing. So I haven't decided when these will be, but these are going to be a giveaway as a set down the road. So there are those. Uh, next, I believe I got this out of the clearance section, Odd Lied, and it's called Perk Up. It is a stamp and a die set, so you're going to get the stamp set and the dies to cut out the coffee cup. So, happy pumpkin spice season, thanks a latte, happy sweater weather, Perk Up, and I'm Coco for you. And then you can add the little sleeve there to the cup if you want, some hearts, some steam, even a little stain on your um, tablecloth or whatever. So, and as always, um, all of our stamp sets come in pockets. Um, they always, um, when you get these, again, if you're not familiar with Close to My Heart, do not throw this piece away. This is like a stamping aid. Um, if you're having issues, with images that have solid sections. Um, after seasoning your stamp, which I've discussed before, and I'll probably bring it up again. I think I'm gonna do a stamping one-on-one -on -one video down the road. But um, you use this, um, you lay it down, you put the cardstock or whatever it is you're gonna stamp on on top, and then you stamp your image. And what it does is when you're pressing down it has just a little bit of give back there so that more so that your image gets a better contact versus stamping onto a flat um, background. Um, it's it's a really great aid. Um, you know, if you don't even if you don't have any of our stamps, if you have like a mouse pad or a self healing mat, if you flip it over and has that like non slip foam back, use that. It'll give you the same result. So, and then here is the die set. All of our dies come on their own magnetic sheet, so you don't have to run out and buy that, um, which is my favorite way to store all my dies. Um, 
regardless of what company I always put all my dies onto magnetic um, sheets for safe storage so there is that one next um, I honestly I can't remember if this is one I already picked up or not if it is I'm gonna be putting this in a giveaway if not um, I'll just be having fun with it but it is called around the clock and it is a what do you call it called like an action set um, it's you have every anything that's outlined in blue uh, there's a matching die to go with the set and this die here for the clock has an area that cuts out the door so that when you open it up the little cuckoo bird will you know show up so thinking of you a little birdie told me grateful for you you are amazing tweet cuckoo and all the time and then other pieces to decorate your clock so and it's a big uh, die set that goes with that one Next, this one's called Full of Beauty, and so it's The World is Full of Beautiful Things Like You. So I just thought that was a positive, I love positive um, affirmation sets, so there's that. This one is called Survivor, and so life is tough, but so are you. Faith, courage, hope. You have been through enough. You have been through the unimaginable. I'm here for you. Brave, resilient, courageous you. I am fill in the blank survivor and then you have the gloves and the ribbon and what I like about this is you can color the ribbon to for whatever pro, uh, not I don't want to say project but you know like a yellow ribbon for the I support the military you know there's so whatever the color ribbon is um, you can color that in so there's that set this one is called let's stay home and honestly, I haven't paid attention to, this is a constant campaign, so it's a limited edition. I believe it is through the end of this month. I'm not sure. It's either this month or next month, but I think it's this month. And based on what's going on, you'd almost think it was made for the issues that we're dealing with today. Uh, keep going. You've been trained for this. Play, read, be grateful, be kind, be calm together all day every day you're home in the news today let's stay home home is where the heart is and current events and then you have little stamps up here so you can do like a dated calendar not quite sure what those are i might have to like look that up and see um that could be like a flower center and you could stamp that like petals i don't honestly i don't know i'm like I said, I'm a, I am a hobbyist. I don't actively like pursue selling close to my heart. Um, I've been with them a total of 10 years. Um, I took a one year break uh, when I had to have my back surgery and physical therapy and all that stuff. Um, and it's just, it was just too much to try and stay active. So uh, anyway, uh, so there's that set. If you have any questions about this, I'll look up the details. And if you're interested, I'll let you know. Um, this next stamp set, set is only available for one month. And this is actually the Maze special. It's, it's We have stamps of the month. And those, they're only available for the one month period. And this one is called Time to Celebrate. And so it's like different sentiments. So... Time to celebrate. Hey there, Mr. and Mrs. Our story starts here. You're the best. Best wishes. Thank you. So proud of you. Birthday times like these. Love you. Hooray. True love. You did it. Congrats. Mothers thinking of you and fathers. And so this happy day is actually two stamps so that you can like insert Father's or Mother's Day. Um, so that's a nice set. Um, as a consultant, we're able to get them like a month ahead of time so I went ahead and grabbed that one this is this month's uh, stamp of the month so you are only able to get this one during the month of April uh, this is a repurchase for me this will be in a future giveaway um, I'm actually considering putting it in the um, memory decks challenge giveaway box 
and this one's called Officially Awesome and basically all the elements to create your own little um, fish bowl. Um, there is no die set to this set so you would have to fussy cut if you want to add like dimensional elements to... Sorry, I'm always watching something on my computer whether you hear the sound or not. Um, so anyway, there is that. This set here um, came out of our clearance section and this is a stamp and die set. So you have this stamp set and then one, two, three, six dies to go with it to cut out these six elements right there. Uh, Merry Christmas, ho, 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 tis the season. Then you have some little squiggly squirrels, swirls down there if you want to use it as a border. Merry Christmas. And um, then you have this right here if you want to use it as like a hanging element to the ornaments. So. so if you're interested in this one, it's in clearance right now until it's sold out. And then this next set um, is part of the Seize the Day that I featured in my last uh, Close to My Heart haul. Because it's nautical related and you guys know my love of everything the sea and nautical. And this is called Seize the Day, and it's the card making stamp set. So we have our bottle, the message that goes in the bottle, some little notes that you can stamp on the message, um, seagulls, some waves, you have the northeast, southwest to stamp with uh, your compass, and then some seashells, and then if you want to add sand in the bottle, and again, the coordinating dies are included with that one. So that is those. Um, next, I bought two packs of the coordinating ca cardstock that goes with the Seize the Day collection. Um, all paper collections that Close to My Heart puts out, they have, they sell coordinating cardstock packs. So they are um, the correct colors if you're wanting to keep within a theme. And so you're not having to hunt down the right colors if you're doing scrapbook pages and etc. There are 12 sheets, um, I believe six colors, two of each. So there, I bought two of those because I'm, I'm considering a mini album out of this collection. And then the last thing I picked up um, on this haul is the Workshop Your Way. Seize the Day card kit. So they always have a card kit and a scrapbooking kit. And um, now this wasn't part of it. This is uh, part of the collection. And I again, I told you I'm looking at doing a mini album. And so I wanted some additional elements to decorate the album. Um, yeah, it just kind of popped out. But these are the card, like the little card stock elements they're not sticky or adhesive but life is better in flip-flops you are my sunshine salty kisses and seashell wishes um surf sun sand there's an anchor hiding back there your seashell relax happy days not all stars belong to the sky and together and then where are you hiding I also picked up these this enamel dot set um, to match the collection again for decorating the mini album. And now the items that are included in the workshop. All the workshops always come with a um, guide that shows you how to cut um, your papers, your pattern papers, your cardstock to make everything featured in there and I like to I keep a binder that I put all this stuff in so there's that it is enough to make 16 cards so you have 16 card bases 16 envelopes it also comes with a roll of five yards of our white ribbon Because it is a card set, um, it doesn't come with much pattern paper. It comes with two sheets um, of this pattern paper in the collection. And um, 
if you go back and look, you'll see how they're used in the workshop. And then these um, cardstock sheets, again, for decorating the cards. And then last but not least, the stamp set that is, ex I believe, exclusive to the workshop. And so the only way to get this is in the workshop, and it also comes with the dies. Um, long time and no see, seize the day. Everything whale be okay and shell, yeah. And so it has um, five dies, the anchor, the crab, the shell, the little whale, and then there's a heart down there. And again, they're mounted on their own magnetic sheet. So that is... That's it. That's that's all I picked up from this haul. Um, but I do have something to share. I meant to share in my last collective haul. Um, I, I knew the whole time before I ended the video, I'm like, I'm forgetting something. I'm forgetting something. And some of y'all who know, I, I love glass dip pens. And some of y'all are like, what is a glass dip pen? Um... A glass dip pen is like a quill, a dip quill, or a quill pen that you dip, but it's made of glass. I'm going to set these down here. And I had to wait for this one to get here. It took literally took the slow boat. It was ordered before our epidemic and shipped before the whole epidemic thing. It just literally took forever to get here. Um, but I'm really excited. Um, it's beautiful. Oh, goodness, where did I just stick you? Oh, Lord. I literally just had it in my hand. Here it is. I blocked it with the, the papers I just put down. It is a pen made completely of glass. And you use it just like, look how pretty that is. You use it just like a quill pen. You have to dip it in an inkwell to write with it. Um, and this, some of y'all will be like, you already have that one. This is very similar to a pen I already have, but that one has a fishtail on the end of it. Um, but if you're curious how they work, these little um, swirly deals here, they're called furrows. And when you dip it in the ink, um, it holds the ink in these little furrows like a, like a well. And as you write, the ink flows down the little, the little um, areas and onto the paper. And as I'm pulling the pen across the paper, it feels pretty smooth. Um, and it looks like they tested it with a red ink because it's got some, a red coloring on the tip. Oh, let me see. I don't, I'm not going to demonstrate it in this video, uh, because it is a process. It's, you know, you got to have your clean water and the ink, and I'm not really prepared to do that at the moment, but, um, I will, and I have been asked to do it. I will pull out. Um, probably next weekend, I will pull out all my glass dip pens, um, for those of you who are interested to be on the lookout for that, because they are really fun to write with. And if you have a good pen and you're using good ink, I can almost write an entire letter, fill up this entire sheet writing on one dip of the ink. I know that seems hard to believe. Um, I have done it. It is, you know, on occasion you might have to do like another quick dip towards the end. Um, but again, super excited <laughs> to finally have this one in my hand. Um, I have reached out. Uh, there's a shop. She's on Etsy. She's not set up right now because she's moved. And so she's setting up her... She actually is... Um, I think she's actually referred to as like a glassmith. She specializes in glass work and, you know, blowing glass. And um, I've reached out to her 
And so I'm just waiting, but she's actually going to send me um, an email of all her current pens that she has available that aren't listed yet. And so I'm hoping, because, oh man, she she does some beautiful, some beautiful work. Um, and so I'm not going to list her right now, but when she does get back up and running, I will um, do another video to share if you're interested because um again her her work is absolutely stunning but um and again next weekend i'll do a more detailed pen uh demonstration there is already one in my library if you want to go try and hunt it down uh but again these are a lot of fun and um so any hoo ha I hope you guys have a great rest of your Sunday. Um, I hope everybody is doing okay with, you know, what's going on in the world right now. Um, we've had some changes going on at work. And you know, fortunately, our hospital is still, we are still situated uh, with supplies. We have started rationing supplies to our staff, but we are not short like I know a lot of the other hospitals are out there right now. Um, so we're very fortunate, but anyway, stay blessed, stay clean, stay healthy. And, um, as always, I love you guys to pieces. Happy crafting. Bye-bye.